quarter here. Look out, Tom Brady. Elvis uh, Doomerville. Ooh. Never see this happen, man. Like, unblocked, totally unblocked. If someone else missed that block, I guarantee you, you will see the waiver wire next week. Yeah, I thought Tom was gone after that. Yeah. It's Not amazing. Tom Brady. He didn't Disaster. Elvis Doomerville hits Heward. Balls loose. Nate Webster picks it up and turns it for six. Great blocking on the play. Great blocking on that return. And Heward is shaken up as the Broncos are up 20 to 8. Heward's shaken up, and now the lineup is shaken. and Doomerville does it again. Look at him get the leverage on Peters. Or knock loose, it usually goes out of bounds. McNabb is tossed down by Doomerville. His second sack today, setting the single season mark in Denver history with 17. Well, what, what's so good, it takes so long. Donovan McNabb hoping for a better option. The short receivers were open, but you can't think that Brent Selleck, a tight end, is going to be able to stop for that long. One of the best pass rushers. Over 43 minutes. A little play action. First down. Chimes in trouble. And does he get out of the end zone? No. It's a safety by the Broncos. Elvis Doomerville gets Derek Newton, just beats him around the corner. Gets pressure, gets around, the coverage down the field, makes Matt Schaub hold that extra beat. Snap to Lossman, they set up a screen, it's going to be intercepted. Elvis Doomerville intercepted, he's got some room to run. Doomerville is going to be slammed to the turf at the 30-yard line, and Denver will end the half on a huge defense. He had the touchdown, a wonderful catch. Broncos on top, 24-23, Elvis Doomerville. It's Rivers, ball comes out, Bonnie Holiday is there, can you get anyone for it, the two minute warning, it's been all Broncos, Manning sacked again, Elvis Dumerville gets his 13th of the season, Elvis is an excellent pass rusher, but again, go back and thank your coverage. They were man-to-man, -man, one free, you'll see the safety down the middle, but manned up everywhere else. Nowhere to throw the ball, excellent coverage. He can't find anyone except for Doomerville, who hits him right in the kisser. Giants will go no huddle here, down 17. Manning, sack, fumble, recovered by the Broncos. Doomerville forced it. DJ Williams recovered it. Elvis Doomerville from Louisville. Gets his second sack of the night. Good coverage, but Doomerville just with a nice move back inside by Deal. Fry, design roll, left side, looks for somebody to throw it to. Can't, has going to be spun around a sack and pulled down behind the line of scrimmage, and the Bronco defense once again comes up with a huge play. Fry mishandles the snap, now turns and hands it to Ruben Drones, who says thanks very much. The ball stripped by Al Wilson, and Elvis Doomerville has it. Al Wilson stripped the ball from Ruben Drones. And Kitna scrambling, sacked by Elvis Doomerville, but Elvis yanks Kitna down by the face mask. That is a penalty. That is a fresh set of downs for Detroit. Four plays later, Kitna. <laughs> Fakes it to Powell, and Sanchez wants to load and go on, and he's going to go down instead. Elvis Dumerville, who a couple of years ago led the league in sacks, has got the second sack of the night for the Broncos. He led the league because of his power and because he's relentless. Here he's working on Mulligan, Matt Mulligan, and this is the relentless version. Throw him off, quarterback is still alive, go get him. Great acceleration to the ball and a big play. And of course, his second down ball. There's McCoy in for the injured Whedon, and McCoy is going down. Down for San Diego. Two minutes and 19 seconds to work with here into the second quarter. Rivers. Is sacked. 
Elvis Doomerville. Ian Vaughn Miller celebrating after the hit on Phillip Rivers. It's a loss of 13 on the play as Rivers kept drifting back. Yeah, not where you want to go. You want to step up into the pocket. But uh, the speed rush by Doomerville gets the corner there on Dombrowski. And uh, Schilling coming over to help actually provided the impetus for Doomerville to get the sack. We've hit the two-minute warning in San Diego. John Elway making his way to the Denver sideline. There, there, there. 108 to play in the fourth. Broncos crowd the line. Here comes the rush. Rivers steps up. And Rivers dropped at the 29-yard line. Doomerville there for Denver. And a loss of 10 on the play. And Denver ought to be thinking about using their timeouts now. Because they have the advantage. Doomerville around the left side there. Remember, Dombrowski was shaken up. In field goal range, just at the edge of it on third and eight. Rivers in as he throws. The ball is free. Another lose, but this one is scooped, and it may score with Tony Carter, who is free and all the way home for a game-changing score. I told you to scoop and score. <laughs> I tell you what, <laughs> listen to me. That's why I'm out of the profession. Take a look at it. You bring pressure off the left side. You create a one-on-one -on -one situation in Doomerville. Does what he's done for a long time. That's a fumble, and that's an impact game-changing turnover for the Bronco defense. Paul gets hit before his arm goes forward. He does not have possession of the ball when, it go, when the arm goes forward. Clearly a fumble. After review, the ruling on the field is confirmed. The defensive player hits the quarterback's hand before it starts forward, causing the fumble. It is a touchdown. For the Steelers, Elvis Doomerville sacks Roethlisberger. Ball's loose on the ground. Who's going to pick it up? It Scoopin is score. Tim Scoopin Crowder. Score. Yeah, that play destined for failure. Bad snap. Quarterback puts his hands down, takes his eyes off the field. Destined for failure from the beginning. 50-yard touchdown in the... It is Barber. But he is going to be stripped by oh. Wesley Woodyard. Oh, boy. No. They're in field goal the range. No, he did So he didn't go out of bounds any fumble? Yep. Every day, when Tebow was their quarterback, third and four... Balls knocked out, picked up by Denver, and then it comes out again, and I think Newton in the end falls on it. Second down and six. Here comes the rush, Doomerville. There's a fumble. Down he went. Clock continues to go. It is the fourth sack offered by the Denver Broncos, and that is all. Inside of Moss right, Champ Bailey's on Randy Moss. Walter fumbles the snap. Goes down, still can't get it. I'm wondering if the Broncos got it. They did. Walter fumbled the snap, and Elvis Doomerville scooped it up, and that's going to do it. Final score, Denver 14, Oakland. Very beneficial unless you turn it over inside your own red zone. Please. Please don't remind you of his youthfulness. Alvin McKinley sacks Jackson. Doomerville recovers, and out comes. 34-yard gain five plays later. It's third and goal. Favre. Runs out of time. Elvis Doomerville knocks it away. Jets recover. That leads to Elvis Doomerville had four sacks in the second half alone. Tied a franchise record. He bags Brady Quinn there. That led to a Browns punt. Fever for Denver, number 26. Campbell. Get from behind. Elvis Doomerville. Had help putting him down. He and Darryl Reed. The guy is only five foot. Well, they list him at 5'11. There he is right at the bottom, number 92. And again, it's, he's initially blocked very well by Stefan Heyer. And then Doomerville gets in to help clean up. But the